All right, all right. Wow, this is crazy. I know y'all like, why does he keep interrupting every almost five, six minutes? Because I'm doing this little report. I mean, recording, pre-recording, and it's like seven minutes is the free play. I'm just seeing if I could literally feel like two hours or up to two hours in it, which is me talking about. It's kind of going a little bit easy. I don't know how many videos I'm through, but you know. I'm just talking. My message probably five, six in. I don't know what part we are. Yeah, y'all. I'm sure that I, I, hopefully I'm still up and I'm scrolling part one and part two. I'm hopefully, and hopefully I'm looking at it as you are. If someone's looking at it out there, oh my God, let me stop talking and just get back to it. But we are continuing the conversation with the, the panel that I barely get to talk on. It's funny that I'm, but now I can talk, I guess. So let's listen. Right there, they put them straight on the wall when they do that. They look right. just put them in the vagina like like we we came out straight. It doesn't matter. Straight, uh, it doesn't matter. Vagina, it doesn't matter. It doesn't That's matter. different. It we have to navigate that whole tunnel. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. You know, you know these hoes. But I don't like today. I know. I know. But this is what I don't like. Okay, you don't like black women. Okay, fine. No, brother. But here's the thing: you can't just kill them. We, that was a long canal. We had. You can't put them in prison. advocating just <laughs> killing us, real. Yeah, killing them, put them in prison. Yeah, they want to do all that. But that, that you can't say that because you don't like black women. That, well, 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 if they have some of the sperm cells don't make it, then that's a crime, and that's murder, and we put them all in prison. It's so mean and stupid. They're really what what white people are really trying to do. White people have been raping black women since the beginning of time. So much so that women like Danica and Verbal and Mella don't even consider it rape anymore. They love these white men. I talked about that in the urban demographic. The only thing these black women love more than these jobs that these white men give them are the white men that give them these jobs. They love them white. <laughs> yeah, I know. Uh, I know you heard that. <laughs> I didn't do it. That's why I call her the toughest internet gangster ever, man. Like, <laughs> who would say something like that and like literally not care? But like, that's the one thing. I'm, just on a side note, real quick. That's the one thing I will say about this YouTube game. I think if you're talking a lot of shit, like such as. An example, this young man right here, or, or this elder, he ain't even a young man. He's an elder talking like this. You know what I'm saying? He's supposed to be dropping jewels, but I guess he is in a sense or not on how not to act. But uh, nevertheless, I think if you're going to be talking shit like this, especially on this platform or, or in this sector, you should really cam up. Like, I, I, I will say I will respect Angry Man because even the, all the shit he be talking, he came up and talked that shit. Like, you know, it's a few other folks like that. I'm just saying, like, I can respect that. You know what I'm saying? Like, a little bit more. I mean, I might not necessarily agree with what they're saying, but I think that if you're going to say some bullshit like that, like, even in this case, that you should, you should, know what I'm saying, cam up. Like, let's look in your eyes and let's see if you really mean this shit, for real, for real. Or you just wolfing the cell. You know what I'm saying? Your content, which is... Your choice as well, but I, I just think you need to give your audience that if you're going to be this um, abrasive, so to speak. So, but they've been raping black women. Hey, I'm happy you brought that out, real brother. Because, yeah, they do. It is a lot of bad witches in this, uh, in this, in, on the planet. And a lot of people don't want to, um, right. don't want to, uh, they want to be able to, they want to be able to force you to have their baby. And we call conscious, we'll shake your baby. A woman should be able to have a right to choose who she has a baby on. These white people can't get yeah, and she chooses it. real brother. She chooses that. She chooses that by picking the person she wants to have a baby by, not by color, not by a culling process like some puppies killing right. the, killing the babies by the men who you had sex with that you don't want to have a baby with. No, that's right. not right. Right, right. So, so they pick the person. Well, what he's saying is they pick the person who rapes them, and because they that? no, I didn't say that. Real. <laughs> who is doing that? That's all I want to know. Who's doing that? Who's doing what? Who pick the person who rapes them? Say what now? Say it again. He's saying that black women what take I the said, white women who rape them. I said they take the father they by picking the person. Hold on, hold on. I can't hear you. Yeah, yeah, I said they take the father by picking the person that they have sex with, yeah. not by killing the baby after they have sex, after they have a baby, after they get pregnant by a guy who they didn't want to have a baby with. Right. Well, that's a lie. Cool. So if right. you didn't want to have a baby with a guy. Are, are black men protecting their seeds? Man, that's what my dad told me. Always protect your seeds, son. Right. Well, you have things in there. Protect your seeds. Yeah, but that, that's, a different, that's a different point, though. That's right, you have a million. If, if you don't protect your disease, she can't get pregnant. But right, because she can't get pregnant. So if she doesn't get pregnant, the black race dies off, and we're not interested in that. Come nigga. Now, what we are, <laughs> what we are interested. 
is black women should not have to have a motherfucking rapist white boy's baby or some nuts. What are you oh, talking about? doing that? Can you name one case that that's happened to in the last 10 years? A uh, hundred million cases. Can you name one? Yeah, well, let's name say the, the, white, the white girl in Ohio. No, you said black women that choose white men that raped them. Oh, Name yeah. one of those women. DJ Kid. Uh, who else? He, he was uh, raping women or having sex with women and telling me he didn't have AIDS? Yeah. Or DJ Kid wasn't raping women. Yeah, he was, 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 was having sex with women. DJ Kid wasn't raping women. He didn't have, have AIDS. AIDS. That's not right. Now, he, he did but now he did have sex with some underage girls, which would be considered statutory rape. Oh, did but he? As far oh. as forcible rape, no, he right. wasn't forcibly raping anybody. Oh, I just right. thought they were, like, he actually like, he actually said ripping. that women women yeah, were actually paying him to have sex with them. He well, said that on his Facebook. Of well, course uh, they were, because these women hate crazy. black men and they love white men. They think white men are, are God. But we don't want black women. That can't be the women. case. Oh, oh, can't be a couple of them probably got a little AIDS baby running around this motherfucker. I would doubt. I mean, hopefully the baby didn't wasn't conceived with AIDS, but that is possible though. Yeah, absolutely. But anyway, so yes, we want women to be able to make a choice. And you don't think women make life. that choice? Like, I don't no, know too many black women don't. who've been with white men who raped them. And uh, okay. Okay. Them. okay. Do we'll you? see that. Well, uh, yes, every single one of them. So, what? What I'm, what? yeah, if they, love, if they think every white man is Brad Pitt and Donald Trump, then yes. Well, then if that's the case, then they don't think they raped them, yeah. real brother. No, but that's not the point point is they should be able <laughs> to use birth control the reason now this is what happened after Planned Parenthood came to the United States right in like 1919 the population uh, was about 15 million right today the population is 325 million Planned Parenthood came to Africa in 1975 same thing there was about 15 million 16 million black people in the, on the continent of africa today one that's not true five, my brother 1.5 trillion and i'll prove it to you right now Real brother you just say stuff <laughs> all right well let's go to the population of so africa. you said white people help the african civilization grow absolutely <laughs> 